Hello everyone, welcome back to Recreation Gaming TV. This video is gonna this video is gonna be about a shout out, a thank you to someone, and Halo Five. So I'm gonna begin with the shout out and a thank you. So I want to say thank you to the Smurfy18. I hope I'm I said his YouTube channel name right, and I'm giving him giving him the shout out because. He helped me gain a lot of subscribers before he gave me a shout out in his video and I'll explain why soon I had 105 subscribers and right now I currently have 119 subscribers which is insane if you ask me that may not seem like a big difference but to me that's a me that's a big difference like I really appreciate that that his subscribers came over to my channel and checked it out and actually subscribed to my channel and I all it's all thanks to the smurfy 18 now I'm gonna explain to you how this all happened so I was looking at Elgato's uh, video for their gaming chat link because I had purchased it and it arrived at my house and I could record chat the the voice chat slash party chat perfectly fine but I wasn't getting any game sound for some reason and literally I look at the comments and I see Smurfy commenting that he ordered it, but and he could get the chat audio very clearly, just like I can, but he couldn't get the game sound. And during that time when I saw the comment, I, I figured out the problem as to why the game sound wasn't recording. And it had to do with the stereo headset adapter on the Xbox One. And he, he for months, he's been trying to figure out how he could like make these videos where he could record the voice and party chat, but also have a little bit of the game sound in there as well. And when you purchase the Elgato gaming chat link, you have to on the Elgato software you have to put the audio to analog audio, and what that pretty much does is it records whatever your headset is hearing. And on the stereo headset adapter, there's five buttons on it. On the left side of it, you have the game controller icon and you have the person icon. What that does is whichever one, whichever one you click on it gives you more of the game sound or the chat sound so for those of you that don't know if you do buy the headset adapter it does allow you to hear game sound through it and for me i had the chat sound all the way up to 100 percent and no game sound coming from it because i have eternal beach which has a which has an amplifier on the y where you can just control the game sound from there but for some reason the elgato it doesn't record the game sound from that it records it from the headset adapter so all you pretty much do is you just click on the controller icon a few times and you'll hear the game sound and that's it your problems are solved and he thanked me pretty much because I helped him solve his problem and it was just crazy because he literally gave me a shout out in one video like the entire video him explaining what he was trying to do and, and saying thank you to me and all that stuff so yeah I want you guys to go check out his channel uh, I'm going to put a link in the description to see his channel he makes a lot of videos they're good quality content. They're actually pretty funny. I've seen a few videos already. They're actually very funny. And I'll link the video also to him giving me a shout out if you guys want to check that out. So, again, the Smurfy18, I really appreciate what you have done for me. It means a lot to me. Don't worry, man. I got your back. I will watch your videos. I already have. And I'm looking forward to your newer videos. Don't worry. I got your back. And thank you very much for giving me a shout out and helping me gain subscribers. And this is someone... That has like over 50,000 subscribers. He didn't need to do this at all. But he decided to. And I'm very thankful for that. But let's get on with it now to Halo 5. Now with Halo 5. I don't know if you guys. I don't think I ever mentioned this. This was a game I was really looking forward to. For the longest time now. And I was loving everything I was seeing about the game. I didn't play the beta. Because I didn't have a gold membership at the time. And when the game released and remind you I bought the game digital I did not like it this game was the biggest disappointment to me ever I, well maybe not ever but I just did not like the way the multiplayer played and you guys know me when it comes to shooting games I really get them just for the multiplayer I don't really care for the campaign the, it depends on what franchise it is like I'll give you an example Shooting games, I care about the campaign as games like Uncharted and Gears of War. I love the campaign. I'll get the game for both the campaign and the shooter. And Halo 5, I just didn't like the way it played out. I didn't like how you started with an assault rifle and a pistol and that you didn't start with battle rifles or DMRs. 
I just didn't like the way the people played and all that stuff. It just, it really disappointed me. I, it was completely different. It, like to me, it did not feel like a Halo game at all. And I'm recording this as of January 17, 6, 10 p.m. And I played the game earlier today. And you know what? Like, I only played one match, but which is what you're watching right now, which which is this match that you're looking at right now. I did good in this match. I was like, huh. I uninstalled the game and everything, but like weeks before, like maybe like a few days after the game released. And I decided, you know what? I paid $60 for this game. Let me give it another shot. So I just played that one match. Now that was just one match, so I, I can't say that I like the game or whatever. But it's like I'm gonna I'm gonna give it another go. See if I can if I can actually end up liking the game because I didn't like the game before. But yeah, and I understand that this game Halo Five. It's not like Halo Four. Well, it, it has similarities, but it's not like previous Halo games is, is what I should say. And I, I, I always say this when it comes to shooting games, you always have to learn to adapt to new shooters because they're the reason one of the major reasons why people don't like playing other shooters is because they simply cannot adapt to the game. So I'm hoping that if I allow myself to play this game a little bit more, which I'm not this isn't going to be my first go to game whenever I, you know, turn on my Xbox one, but I'm going to make an attempt to at least play this like, you know, give us play the game a little bit more to see if I can end up liking it. If not, I'll just uninstall it and it'll be whatever. I, I, I tried, but I just couldn't I just couldn't love it or get into it. But yeah, so that's pretty much this video. So you might see more Halo 5 gameplay. I'm not too sure. We'll have to see. But yeah, so again, the Smurfy 18, I really appreciate what you got what you have done. It means a lot to me. Again guys, please check out his channel. Check out his videos. He's he makes good quality content and he helped me gain a lot of subscribers. So that that's that I'm very thankful and appreciative for that. So again, guys, thank you very much for watching. Uh, comment down below. Let me know what you think about Halo 5 and me getting more subscribers and what you think about Smurfy's channel. Uh, if you didn't like the video, you can dislike. I don't got a problem with that. Uh, if you're new to the channel, subscribe if you like my content obviously if you're thinking about subscribing i would like you guys to check out my other videos before you decide to subscribe but anyways thank you very much for watching you guys have a great day or you have a good night and enjoy the rest of the video